Hi, my name is Dr. Ofer Feinaro and I'm a reproductive endocrinologist. I work at the IVF unit and also head of the Laboratory for Reproductive Immunology at Hillel Yaffe Medical Center, affiliated to the Technion Israelis Institute of Technology. I'm here to present our work, um, namely immature myeloid cells derived from mouse placentas and malignant tumors, demonstrate similar proangiogenic transcriptional signatures that was performed here in our laboratory and in uh, collaboration with um, Weizmann Institute of Science and um, the Department of Structural Biology in Stanford University. Our study looks into uh, placental angiogenesis uh, and the similarities between placental angiogenesis and tumor angiogenesis. In a previous study we showed that um, immature myeloid cells, which are um, as their name says, they are incomplete, uh, incompletely matured cells um, that, are, or, that originate from the bone marrow, infiltrate both the placentas and the tumor, and um, they, in a very similar fashion, promote angiogenesis. So we sought to determine in this study, are these really uh, similar cells? Are these cells that um, express similar genes? So what we did is we, we grew um, uh, tumors in mice and also looked at placentas from pregnant mice and we isolated using flow cytometry the, the immature myeloid cells and then we looked into their global gene expression. Now the novelty in, in this study is that we looked um, at the, the complete set of genes from all our tissues using the mass distance algorithm. And this is a, a novel algorithm in, this, in the sense that it can test similarity between, between samples and not their differences. This is, are these um, uh, gene, genes really similar? Are these expression patterns really similar? And what we've found is, is that uh, around 500 genes were uh, expressed in a very, very similar fashion. Um, uh, genes such as IL-1 beta, S uh, 100A8, S 100A9, all these genes um, are um, important inflammatory genes and also genes that are involved in angiogenesis. And more interestingly, we even found clusters of genes that um, show that there are some unique expression patterns for immature myeloid cells derived from the uh, placenta and also unique um, gene expression sets from the uh, uh, tumor derived immature myeloid cells. So there our conclusions from this study are that there are mostly similar genes um, and these cells are probably very similar in both origin and function but also the niche, the, the place where the um, hosts these immature myeloid cells influences very specifically the gene expression and we found some uh, placenta specific uh, gene expression such as LIF JAG1, and also we found tumor-specific IMC uh, gene expression such as CXCL9, TWIST, TGF beta receptor 3, and MMP3. So um, our study uh, shows for the first time that not only cells, immature myeloid cells that are recruited into the tumor and recruited into the placenta are of similar functions, they also have their specific um, gene expression. Now, this study is, is one of the pioneering ones in order that looks into the molecular mechanisms of, of placental angiogenesis and tumor angiogenesis uh, in, in the contents of their similarity. And we hope that our studies may pioneer others that may look into the molecular aspects that will show what are the origins of placental diseases or malfunctions, such as preeclampsia, intrauterine growth restriction. So, in order to, uh, for you to look more into our study, we invite you to look into the printed study and also into the supplemental material that we, we um, will be published online in Fertility and Sterility. So thank you very much.